Hey guys, this is Shane Dublin, and this is part of my mini-series on Mechanism. For this one, I'm going to be showing you guys how to store and how to move energy. Now, there's a few different ways to get energy, however, there aren't that many ways to store and move it. To store the energy, you are going to need these energy cubes. Ba there's basic energy cubes, there's advanced energy cubes, there's elite energy cubes, and there's ultimate energy cubes. The basic stores 2 megajoules, Advanced is 8 megajoules, Elite is 30 megajoules, and Ultimate is 32 megajoules. Now, to transfer energy from a power source or another energy cube, you will need these energy conduits, or energy cables. They're just cables. And each of them is capable of transferring a different amount of energy per tick. So these first ones are capable of moving 500 energy joules a tick, and the advanced ones are capable of moving 2 kilojoules, 8 kilojoules, 32 kilojoules. And the way these cables work, they kind of work like mini storage, or mini energy cubes, because each of these cables stores a little bit of energy in them. So it's not like instantly transferring, it has to like fill this one up and then fill this one up and then fill this one up, it's almost instant, but each of these holds some energy. And to get energy out of the energy cube, you need to hook the either the machine or the cable up to it and hook it up to the output side, which is this little this little tab in the middle. So it's hooked up to the tab and you can't feed energy into the tab just to any of the other five sides. And these are all pumping energy out. As you can see, it's filling up. And one thing to note is there is no energy loss through these cables. Unlike some of the other mods, they might have energy loss, but this one doesn't. The energy cubes can accept a lot of energy f from the other sides. So for example, you can pump pump purple ultimate energy cubes into a green energy cube and it'll fill it up super fast however you can't pump it out very fast and another thing to note is this is fully compatible with a bunch of other mods for example thermal expansion and initial craft build craft they all of these energy cables act and energy cubes act as a converting tool between the mods so if you want to use, for example, industrial crafts, advanced solar generators or something like that, you can convert that energy into thermal expansions energy, and you can have tons of energy that way if you use these as a go-between for the tools. And that's about it for energy transfer and energy cubes. If you want to know the recipes, I highly recommend installing not enough items. This is what it looks like. You just type in what you need and you can look up the recipe by just clicking on it if you're not in creative mode or pressing R if you are in creative mode or you can look at the wiki for the recipes if you like this video give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down if you didn't like it I'll respond to any of your questions and feel free to follow me on YouTube and on Twitch where I'll be doing let's plays and playing some other video games thanks for watching guys appreciate the support